Hello everybody, my name is Edson and welcome to what is quite possibly the worst sound known to mankind. It is dying weird Minecraft creatures. Oh my gosh, it's so horrible. I need to turn this off. Not skin customization. Oh, I've never heard a sound that's so bad than that. Oh, it's so horrible. Okay, so um, what I'm doing is I, I've been going AFK just a little bit. Um, I'm because what I'm going to do in today's episode is um, that's a few extra things. Now I need to remember to turn this. Uh, there you go. I need to remember to turn this, these sounds back. I'm going to do it now because I forgot to turn the sounds on last time, and we were streaming last night on. Mike doing some Minecraft UHCs and a creeper snuck up on me and nearly killed me because <laughs> I didn't hear the tss. so yeah that was quite bad but what we're going to be doing today I'm going to take a quick wander over there while I um while I talk and tell you guys what we're going to be doing um and we are going to essentially start work on the PBS uh, base now I've done a little bit of planning during the live stream as promised and the reason that we're doing this um, is because, I don't know, it's, it sucks because I, I touched upon it last episode, um, Fultron, Tor and Anasia all can record, well, Fultron and I think Anasia can record relatively decent time um, in sort of correlations to when I normally record, but Fultron and Tor, um, they really can't. And it kind of sucks because obviously... <laughs> Like, I, I, I know for a fact, like, Anasia can definitely make the recording times that they do. She just needs to know in advance. Um, Fultron and Tor pretty much record the similar times, so they're pretty good. Uh, whereas myself, I'm the Brit, and it sucks. This is the one thing I hate. Uh, the one thing that really does suck about Time Shot for me is the fact that I hardly ever get to record without anyone as much as I would like to. Um, it just, I don't know, it ne never normally happens. And I don't know why you always go over the boob. <laughs> I always have to touch the boob. Every time I come here, gotta touch the boob. <laughs> uh, oh, that thing's got to go as well. So, um, we've done some planning during the live stream. And this place um, is going to be, obviously, this completely secret location that nobody knows where it is. Um, hold for sub base. We're going to... Um, <laughs> we're going to... Turn this into PBS's new headquarters. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to somewhere here, we're going to build... Oh, no, there it is. That's the center point. So we're going to build like a circle around here that goes down into the floor. And then... Um, so it's going to be like a mountain, a mini mountain thing there, and you have to like end a pearl into it. It's going to be like a volcano -y type thing. Um, we're going to strip all these trees around here, probably have some like dead trees around here, I'm thinking. Um, we're going to get rid of this because... It's not done and it is a little bit hideous. Um, so what we need to do during tonight's live stream is uh, clear all these trees, probably rip that down, um, start probably the work on the outside slash the, the mountain. Um, and then after that, um, we should have a pretty decent sort of location as to where we're gonna do this. Now I've been planning what we're gonna be doing during the live stream and obviously that pillar that I showed you this is where it comes down so we're going to build like a circle here so you have to like end a pearl into it and it drops down into slime blocks i think that'll be a cool idea uh so welcome to the future site of pbs hashtag not cool uh, we're gonna have the meeting room through here this was already dug out in like a little st uh automated storage thing so that was quite good uh, we're gonna have pearl storage here we're gonna i don't know what's there uh we're gonna come down here um I've sort of stripped out a bit of the wall there. Uh, it's going to be member wall, uh, member info wall type thing. We're going to have um, Endermite Shrine here somewhere. Um, we're going to have Sacrifice to Ender Gods here. So I'm trying to use the the already dug out spaces that Holdfast has used um, or sort of like made. I'm trying to sort of keep them there, but we're going to change it up to the um, to the PBS sort of like color scheme so we, these are the blocks these are all the blocks that we used in the secret hideout that we've got so we've got coal blocks we've got purple stained glass we've got prismarine bricks we've got prismarine we've got blue uh purple stained clay sorry um wait 
Oh, damn it. I've just realised we use blue stained clay that looks purple. I don't know if we can... We might use purple. We might use blue. I don't know. Um, end stone. Uh, stone slabs. Dark prismarine. And sea lanterns. So they're, they're the nine blocks that we're going to be using. This may change to blue stained clay. I remember we used blue stained clay, but it looks purple. So I made purple accidentally. I need to make blue stained clay. Does he have any lapis? So I can see what blue stained clay looks like. He must have. He must have a little bit of lapis. They can't have taken all of the ores. Maybe they did. Damn it. I think they probably did. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Okay. Um, so we'll figure that out later on. Um, but what I, what I want to do is I want to um, and then obviously after all of this area I'm not entirely sure what we're going to do down here um, he had like a chicken storage area we opened this up and it exploded millions upon millions of chickens into us um, so he's got this area here he's got like some food area here I've kind of broke the redstone I think so I don't think any of it actually works now um, this was the little thing that went up to the meeting room so this was like uh, well, went up to his storage area, uh, so that like automa automatically smelted things. I think I'm not entirely sure. Then he has here that goes down to like a strip mine. Uh, like I say, I'm not entirely sure um, what we're going to do with that area there. But up to this point, I know what we're going to do. So we are going to start off by taking this room here, um, bar the meeting room. So like, cut it off here as such. We're taking this entrance area here. Um, and this storage thing here, and we're going to try, uh, I think we'll probably go up to like here. So like if we have an invisible line here to there, so it's just like this little entrance here, we need to build like a little thing with slime blocks here. We need to sort of like keep these uh, chests here, but change the blocks up a bit um, and change the pattern and all of that. And we're going to use these bricks to do that. And you guys are join me back and hopefully it looks all PBS like. So let's do it. And we are back. So I've been working on it a little bit. Um, I've been out. I've been to the gym. I've come back. I've done a little bit more work. And I'm just real. Why? Well, since I've been doing that, I've realised a few things that we um are short. And that is obviously the blue stained clay, which I kind of messed up on. I made purple, and that's because Mo Yang are colour blind and don't know the difference between blue and purple. Um, and I also need some leather. Um, for the Oh, uh, what's it? The chest and stuff. Why am I going over here when his portal's over here? Uh, so I need to nip back to my place. Once we've nipped back to our place, I can show you the work that I've done. Um, and what is going to be done, hopefully, during the live stream tonight. So as you guys see this, I'm recording this the day before you've seen it. Um, and we are heading into a live stream tonight. Um, everyone and their mum and their dog and everything, Granny's aunts everyone is seems like they're currently streaming <laughs> minecraft story mode on twitch as i am currently recording this and everyone will be streaming that tonight because it's the day it releases and me i'll be playing on time shot <laughs> i've been debating i've been really debating whether to get it um i've said it i've said before that i was going to record it for youtube i've sort of backed away from that now um because i honestly think let's plays are more I'd better suit me to Twitch now. Um, and here's the thing, right? I'll talk to you guys about this while I'm going to get all the stuff. So, Minecraft Story Mode, originally when it was announced, I was like, yes, this is going to be awesome. Telltale Games, I really like The Walking Dead. Um, I've never played the Borderlands games, but that's just because I'm not really into the Borderlands series as such. Um, it's not that I don't like the Borderlands series, and I'm just going to take a sip of my coffee. That is nice. Okay, so it's not that I don't like the Borderlands series. Um, it's that I've never had enough time. I've never actually found the time to play it. So I don't know whether I would actually enjoy that. And I don't know if I need to play the games first, play the the Telltale game or what. I don't know. So I've just stayed away from the Borderlands series because I've never had time to play the first one. Then I was like, well, if I haven't played the first one, I'm not going to play the next one. I've just never played any of the series. It's just one of those series that have just it's become lost on me. I've, I've never managed to find time to play it. It kind of sucks, because I feel like it may be a game I might enjoy. Because um, people that like similar games uh, to me 
um, do like Borderlands, so maybe it's a game that I may uh, enjoy in the near future. But um, so I was I was very hyped for Telltale Games when they originally announced this. Now, do we have any normal clay? Oh boy, so much! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We'll get a full stack of or eight stacks. So we'll get a full stack of lapis and turn this into blue stained clay, which is actually purple because Mo Young are colorblind. Um, so. I was extremely excited for it because Telltale Games, everything that I've played of them, everything that I've seen of them, everything that I've heard of them so far, um, it's been positive for me. Uh, I know they've had have some questionable, really old games, um, and some people, it's kind of like Marmite with uh, Telltale. You either love them or you hate them. I've, I've never met someone that's like, meh, they're okay. <laughs> I've either met someone that has loved everything they've ever done. See, how is this blue? Who freaking Mojang thinks this is blue? Ridiculous. Okay. Um, maybe I'm colorblind. I don't know. <laughs> so, yeah, it's like everyone that I've spoke to either loves Telltale or cannot... Oh, please, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Or absolutely hates um, all of their games. So, and to be fair, I really like the game that I've played from them. Walking Dead series, um, so I was really looking forward to it, and it's it's one of my favourite games. Minecraft is, and Telltale is to me one of my, a great publisher, one of my favourite game publishers for story side of things. So I'm, I was really looking forward to it, and I was thinking, yep, definitely a game I'm going to uh, record on YouTube. Since then, I've sort of moved away from Let's Plays on on YouTube. I've more moved them towards Twitch. So. The whole me wanting to record it for YouTube slowly died out. And it, it wasn't because people, um, loads of people are going to be recording it. That's That would never be a reason why I would um, why I would not record something because loads of other people are recording it. Which is obviously the case. It's a new game. It's a very popular game. Loads of people are trying to fight for number one spot on YouTube with it. And yeah, there's a lot of people that are recording it. I know dozens upon dozens of people that are recording it right now as I record this. The day it's out. I probably know about 20 people that are recording it right now. So there's a lot of content going up on it. And I was thinking, well, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to stream it on Twitch because I'm really enjoying streaming single player games on Twitch. We've streamed the Stanley Parable. We've streamed uh, Portal. We're going to be streaming Portal 2. We've got a list of loads of other uh, single player games that we're going to be streaming. We just like every so often we go, right, we're streaming a single player campaign today. Uh, you guys vote sort of thing. And it's, it's been going really well. So I was like, you know what? I'll still get it. And I will um, I, I'll just stream it on, on Twitch because it'll be fun. And then that way, anyone that hasn't, um, hasn't managed to get it can hopefully then watch the stream. And if they miss the stream, they can just watch the past broadcast. And it's all there. And they can just flick through and watch what they want and all that good stuff. So I was like, yeah, that's perfect. I can just play it on Twitch. But... Oh, I just realised I've taken that out. <laughs> so this is what we've done so far. I'll carry on this this talk in a second. Um, I don't. I think we're gonna have to work this blue stained clay, the glass, into the ceiling somehow. Um, I think that's what we're gonna have to do. We're gonna have to work that into the ceiling somehow. Every other block, apart from the sea lanterns, is worked in here. We don't have any slime. Oh, I was gonna get slime. Damn it! Ah, uh, that was another thing that I was gonna get. Right, let me pop these over here. Right, so just a quick side thing on this. This is all that we're going to be doing for now. And we are going to be um, heading over to Faves, getting a load of slime blocks. Probably, how many do we need? Eight plus eight, 16. We need 16. So I'll get 20 slime blocks just to make sure. Um, and this is all we've done so far. We need to light it up. We need to do the roof. We need to cut out the hole and then we need to work more on this, which we're going to be doing in tonight's live stream. So hopefully that will go down well and you guys will enjoy it. And when you guys join me back in the next episode, hopefully most of this will be done and we can carry on building the final bits and then hopefully um, build the iron statue thing on top of the iron mountain, finally get around to doing that. I'm hoping that Fultron, Tor and Anasia approve of this build. I'm hoping they do. Anyway. <laughs> um... So moving back to that, um, I am just going to go and get the slimes while I'm talking about this. 
Um, so moving back to uh, that, I was thinking, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna stream it on Twitch. It's gonna be good. But then it came out today, and I know like there's a lot of people that get Telltale Games early access. Some of which are um, are Hannah uh, from the Yogscast. Uh, quite all of the Yogscast, if they want to play the game, they get early access to it. Um, which is like probably one of the, the the biggest sort of like let's players in the UK, I would say, um, especially for those sorts of games. Um, and Hannah from the Yogscast is one person that I've I've watched all of the let's plays of the Telltale games from, um, apart from Borderlands because I haven't actually played that. I watched them after I've played them myself. So I watched the Walking Dead one that she's done after I've played it myself. Um, but I normally watch the first episode of all of the let's plays just to make sure I want I it's something that I would like or at least watch the first sort of five to ten minutes. And I watched the first five to ten minutes of Hannah's Let's Play. And I'm going to be honest. I really didn't like it. It felt creepy. I don't know what it was. The game just felt... Like, as I was watching the first five minutes... And I watched like quite a bit of gameplay as well. Like, uh, there's the opening cutscene. The, the, the first bit of footage that you're watching. And where's Fave's place? Is that this one? poet no okay um so i watched the first bit of footage and it felt cringy it felt creepy and it didn't feel like they've even successfully aimed i don't know they've successfully made it for ki oh gosh for kids to enjoy i don't think kids are going to enjoy it that much especially people that enjoy minecraft i think it's going to be a bit slow and stale i don't i honestly don't think it's a game that many people are going to especially watch like maybe playing it it's it's probably quite i i, I would i would still say if i played it i would probably enjoy it i don't think people will want to watch it i definitely don't want to watch it and i've only watched i'll take 30 scenes in actually, i'll take a stack scenes in if he's done that um he's got that many i didn't know he had that many yeah, I, I don't even want to watch it. I've just, like, I've watched 10 minutes and it feels cringy, it feels creepy, it feels weird. And it's just, I don't know. It's not my thing. I, d I honestly thought it was, like, w when it was announced, I was like, yep, yeah, this is going to be awesome. But just watching the first five to 10 minutes and I'm I'm face palming. I, don't, I, d I honestly, I don't know what it is. I, I honestly thought it was going to be good. But for me... It maybe doesn't seem like it's for me. I don't know. So sadly, I'm not going to be playing it. I'm not going to be buying it. I don't think it's worth the money um, for the enjoyment I'll get out of it. Maybe in like a year or two's time when all of the episodes are out and it goes on sale for like three, four pound on one of the Steam Summer Christmas sales at 75, 80 percent off, which inevitably will all of the Telltale all of the Telltale games eventually do. Uh, maybe I'll buy it then and then give it a play but it's definitely not worth the 20 pound that it is right now um it's i think it's a little bit less than 20 pound actually but it's definitely not worth that price tag for me anyway and that's just to play it let alone to play it for you guys so i don't think i, w I will actually probably i'm a little bit un unsure if i'm going to enjoy playing it so obviously it's not something that i'm going to get for you guys to my dog's barking now for you guys to um it's it is it's not something that I'm I'm gonna think that you guys are gonna enjoy watching me play, especially when I'm unsure that I'm actually gonna enjoy it. Because it just fit I'll just be there like trying to not make weird remarks at how creepy or weird it is. So I don't know. So yeah, that's my thoughts on it. Um I honestly was in the in the sort of there, there was two lots of people. Loads of people were saying, Yes, this is my thing. A load of people were saying, No, this is not my thing, I'm not gonna be buying it. I was strongly with yes, this is going to be my thing, um, and sadly, over the I don't know over the course of today, my opinion has drastically changed. So I'm kind of happy that I didn't actually pre-order it, which is quite good. Um, so yeah, I'm not going to be playing it sadly. So if any of you guys are looking for that on my channel, um, you can now probably look elsewhere. I'm sorry about that. If anyone was looking forward to me playing it, um, but my views upon it have changed obviously since it's been released so <laughs> that's my stance on 
on Minecraft Story Mode. <laughs> uh, so yeah, that is all that I think I want to talk about today for that. Um, hopefully you guys like this design. This is obviously where we're going to um, drop in. So I'm hoping that we can get something that's relatively easy to see to sort of end a pearl into. And then you're like, end a pearl in, doesn't matter where you land, you'll land on, like it doesn't matter where you end a pearl onto, you'll land onto this slime block. So you won't take any fall damage. You'll just take the initial damage of the ender pearl, like hitting the ground. So it won't be too bad. Um, and then obviously I will, will get rid of this entrance here and build a wall here. So that is... That is the design we're going with. Um, I'm hoping the design can carry on down here and everything. Uh, like I say, like I've tried to remove this, the wooden pillars to coal. Um, and yeah, I honestly think at the minute it's looking okay. I need to work some sea lanterns into this as well to light it up. Uh, we'll be working on this during tonight's live stream though. And hopefully you guys join me back in the next episode on Friday when this is, well, the majority or at least more of this will be done hopefully. So... Hope you guys have enjoyed this. If you did, make sure to leave it a like, make sure to leave it a comment, subscribe if you're new, and as always, I'll speak to you all soon. Take care. <laughs>